Good morning. I'm so happy to share this travel vlog with you. It's my most favorite of the month. We went from bustling streets of London to the idyllic landscapes of Cotswolds just at the end of summer in the UK. So pretty. These beautiful English villages will leave you speechless. Here is where time seems to slow down and the beauty of nature takes center stage. We are doing a day trip to Cotswolds today with our friends. When we started from London, it was so cloudy, but the weather report said only 20% chance of rain. So, we are braving the weather. Yes, baby. <laughs> the Cotswold villages with its rolling hills, meadow filled with wild flowers, and honey colored stone cottages beckons us to discover its timeless charm. Cozy cottages are nestled amidst the countryside, it's just breathtaking. That 20% right now. <laughs> 20% per person, we are five people, so it's 100% right. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bar, yeah. Lovely flowers. Yeah, yeah. so beautiful. It matches the same flower. Oh, it matches your dress. Mm. Matches your dress. Yeah. So floral and floral. Floral. Flora and fauna. Flora and fauna. Self-service. Lovely petite shop there. Laduma, look at that house. It is so pretty, Dam. Morning. Sorry. <laughs> Such a fresh, beautiful morning after rain. It feels so fresh after rain. See how pretty it is. Wow. Typewriter, yeah. 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 Who told you it's a typewriter? Binox. 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 This is again such a lovely pretty village and the weather is also getting better. It has stopped raining. We have started enjoying, really enjoying now. It's such a lovely pretty alley. It's beautiful. <laughs> we are in beautiful market town of Tetbury. It's famous for its former wool industry and today for its great architecture, wonderful antique and boutique shops everywhere. Walking in these streets makes me feel like I'm walking into the past. Really nice. What are you looking at? Uh, uh, Anna um. said that's a horse. I said that's a dog. Is that a horse? <laughs> it's, it's too... I think it's a dog. It's a dog. Yeah. Mm. It's a dog. 
Yes, no. Look, look at look at the thing, the candle. How behind. Oh. And the candle. And you <laughs> candle. The candle will supply. It is perfume. 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 It's really nice. This is Queen and Father Oh, it's famous for antiques. There are a lot of shops. That is also a famous antique shop. In the set of burger. Oh, it's nice. It is so pretty. Dainty. Dainty little tea. It's very nice. This is the junction in the center of the town and there is a marketplace which used to be very famous in the olden days. It's still there. It was built in 1655. This was Wool and Yarn Market. See, the marketplace is still there. It still stands there. too important to be taken seriously it is for me i take things seriously I saw it first. <laughs> <laughs> okay one two okay <laughs> <That is. laughs> Not just in one finger, yeah. all of them. <laughs> They've got lovely earrings also. Nice. Birthday gift. Oh, thanks, baby. Cherry. Choose cherry. 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 Yeah. Gayatri's birthday gift from Ladu. Hmm? Nice, doll. It's really nice. Very nice. Nice, mommy. Very nice place. It's so pretty, da. Oh, soaps. White jasmine. Try this one. It's very nice. Yeah. White jasmine. Price and number. How much? Six ninety-five. Wow. So pretty. Charged up, lifted fourteen nine, lifted. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> so heavy. Nice. It is heavy, it's mm -hmm. so pretty. Everything here is so beautiful.
<laughs> I have to say, from the moment I stepped foot into the small town of Penswick, I was taken back by how beautiful it was. It was a Sunday, so it was extremely quiet. However, I doubt it is ever extremely busy. And so it was perfect for exploring and taking some wonderful photos. Wow! <laughs> Outside it looked so ordinary. Look at inside. Yeah, that's what. So beautiful. <laughs> so beautiful. This beautiful Gothic wool church is in the heart of the village and it is surrounded by passageways and actually 99 yew trees. It was almost like walking through a scene from Allies in Wonderland with its stunning topiary displays. I believe these trees have been around for a thousand years now. My favorite thing was the Tudor style building that is situated next to the church. I love making relaxing, soothing videos. It inspires me when all of you say that you are seeing my YouTube channel as a way to relax, unwind and to clear your mind, to escape from the chaotic and stressful day to a place where it is so peaceful. If you enjoy the content that I share, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and like this video. I would really appreciate that. Thanks. We'll wait in the car. <laughs> it started raining heavy. It's nice and rain. <laughs> nice pretty of thing. I'll serving spoon the very Oh no. And the thing of the veil is also a nice mm. party. Mm. Oh. Oh, party oh. made. Light train is expected to stop in 30 minutes. <laughs> light train? Light train, yeah, very light. Very light. Very light. Very light. <laughs> It looks so nice and fresh after the rain. You can see the bottom. Ah. From London, if you have a car, you can get here in about one and a half hours. With beautiful houses on this side. I'm going to like Beatles said, here comes the sun. They're doing some work here. As a content creator, I'm always looking for things to inspire and drive my creative mind. Hence the trip to Byberry. 
Although there are many beautiful places to visit in the Cotswolds, we decided to visit these villages from a little blog I read on the 10 prettiest villages in Britain. My visit to beautiful Byberry really inspired me. This Arlington Street is one of the Cotswolds most photographed street. In fact, UK passports carry the image of this street on its inside covers. This row of honey-colored stone cottages have been there since the 14th century. It has got so much legacy. The whole of Byberry village looks like it was peeled off from some amazing historical novel. Kudos to the National Trust for preserving this heritage site. <laughs> it's a great scene that feels. <laughs> really big out, huh? Three. Very big. <laughs> She's so happy. <laughs> <laughs> we arrived at Burton on the Water, yet another lovely town in the England's Cotswold Hills. It was 4.30 p.m., which seemed to be the tourist rush hour. All the tea shops were overflowing with people sipping orange pecoe or cappuccinos and forking down fresh baked cake. While it's true that butter on the water is a popular spot, I have to admit that once again, town emptied out by 5.30 and everything got a lot quieter and considerably prettier and more enjoyable. We watched little kids play in the sleepy river, a miniature boat race featuring homemade crafts constructed out of leaves and anything folks could find was taking place. Soon our stomachs propelled us in search of food and drink. After checking menus at several of the many eateries, we settled on the Riverside Cafe. Cotswold is famous for its scones and cream teas. <laughs> So lovely sitting next to the water and we've ordered some green tea and scones and cakes. It is so nice here. It's time for us to leave. We don't want to. We love it here. Honestly, it makes me very emotional. 
If work and money wouldn't be an object, I think we could easily move here. Who knows what's going to happen in the future? Well, uh, the only thing we can do is return. We'll come back here and we hope you like the video. We had a wonderful time. Thank you so much for watching us always and uh, we'll see you again very soon. So until next time, bye-bye.